The Severn Bridge is a motorway suspension bridge spanning the River Severn and River Wye between Ost, South Gloucestershire in England, and Chepstow, Monmouthshire in South Wales, via Beakley, Gloucestershire, a peninsula between the two rivers. It is the original Severn Road crossing between England and Wales and took three and a half years to construct at a cost of a £8 million. It replaced the Ost Ferry. The bridge was opened on September 8, 1966, by Queen Elizabeth II, who hailed it as the dawn of a new economic era for South Wales. The bridge was granted Grade I listed status on November 26, 1999. History The first proposal for a bridge across the Severn, approximately in the same location as that eventually constructed, was in 1824 by Thomas Telford, who had been asked to advise on how to improve mail coach services between London and Wales. No action was taken, and over the next few decades the railways became the dominant mode of long-distance travel, with the Severn Railway Bridge at Sharpness being opened in 1879 and the mainline Severn Tunnel in 1886. However, the growth of road traffic in the early 20th century led to further calls for improvements, and in the early 1920s Chepstow Urban District Council convened a meeting of neighbouring local authorities to consider a Severn crossing to ease congestion and delays on the A48 passing through the town. In 1935 Gloucestershire and Monmouthshire County Councils jointly promoted a parliamentary bill to obtain powers to build the bridge over the estuary, with 75% of costs to be met by the Ministry of Transport from the Road Fund. However, the bill was rejected by Parliament after opposition from the Great Western Railway Company. After World War II, plans began to be made for a nationally funded network of trunk roads, including a Severn Bridge, for which the contract was awarded to Mott, Hay and Anderson, with Freeman Fox and Partners. The public inquiry into the scheme was held on September 24, 1946 at Bristol University. However, because government funding was prioritised for the similar Fourth Road Bridge, construction of the Severn Bridge was not started until 1961. The UK government announced in 1962 that construction costs would be recovered by means of a toll of 260D on all vehicle crossings, though walking or cycling across the bridge would be charge free. The substructure was completed by contractors John Howard and Company in 1963. The superstructure contract was awarded to Associated Bridge Builders Limited in 1963, and completed in 1966. Component Structures the Severn Bridge crossing consists of four structures, which, listed in order from England to Wales, are, the Ost Viaduct, Severn Bridge, Beatley Viaduct and Y Bridge. The Severn Bridge and Ost Viaduct was granted Grade I listed status on November 26, 1999, while the Y Bridge and Beatley Viaduct was granted Grade II listed status on May 29, 1998. Equals Ost Viaduct equals the 514 feet Ost Viaduct is a twin box girder structure with a concrete deck, which carries the roadway from the top of Ost Cliff to the first gravity anchorage of the old Severn Bridge. The roadway is then carried over the top of the concrete anchorage to the Severn Bridge. Equals Severn Bridge equals. The Severn Bridge is located close to the former Ost Ferry. The bridge is a suspension bridge of conventional design with the deck supported by two main cables slung between two steel towers. In 1966 the cables supporting the bridge deck were spun from 18,000 miles of wire. The main cables, are each made up of 8,322 individual 5 mm wires. An unusual feature of the suspension cables carrying the deck is that they are not vertical, as for most suspension bridges, but rather arranged in a zigzag fashion, with adjacent mounts closely spaced. The triangulation this offers is an attempt to reduce vibration, as is the prominent use of stock bridge dampers on the cables. The bridge is 5,240 feet long, consisting of a 3,240 feet central span between the towers and the two 1,000 feet side spans. The towers rise to 445 feet above mean high water and are of hollow box construction. The deck is an orthotropic steel box girder of aerofoil shape with cantilevered cycle tracks and footways supported from the box. The shape of the bridge was determined by the designers Freeman, Fox and Partners following wind tunnel tests for the Fourth Road Bridge, 
after the original wind tunnel model was accidentally destroyed. The sections of the deck were built at Fairfield Maybe in Chepstow, and each 132-ton section was then floated down the river before being hoisted into position. Equals Beatley Viaduct equals. The 2,444 feet Beatley Viaduct is also of similar box girder construction as the Seven Bridge but is supported on steel trestles as it crosses the Beatley Peninsula. The peninsula contains an army camp, which the bridge crosses. Equals Y Bridge equals. The Y Bridge is a 1,340 feet long cable state bridge, which crosses the border marked by the River Y between England and Wales, two miles south of Chepstow. It consists of a single large cable stayed section with two single leg pylons supporting the bridge deck from the center of the roadway. The deck is an orthotropic box girder similar to the Seven Bridge but has a different appearance as it has two sets of cable stays on each of two towers. Originally there was only one set of cable stays but these were replaced during the strengthening works. The Y Bridge was built by Cleveland Bridge and Engineering Company. Post construction changes in January 1977, it was announced that bridge traffic would be restricted to a single lane in each direction following the discovery of several weaknesses in the 10-year-old structure. The lane closures would last for several months. The Seven Bridge Crossing was strengthened and resurfaced in the late 1980s as the weight of traffic grew. The work included the strengthening of the Seven Bridge Towers and Deck an extension to the existing Y bridge towers and the replacement of the original single stays with two stays. The open structure of the new stays is designed to facilitate maintenance. Most of the strengthening work was inside the deck box and towers and so is not visible. The surfacing is a 35 mm thick layer of mastic asphalt over an acrylic waterproofing membrane. Tolls. Shortly after the opening of the Severn Bridge, Anglo-Welsh poet Harry Webb wrote an ode on the Severn Bridge, two lands at last connected, across the waters wide, and all the tolls collected, on the English side. The toll is indeed collected on the English side, and only on vehicles travelling westwards from England to Wales, leading some people to describe it as a tax on entering Wales, both in jest and also as a more serious anti-toll campaign. Originally, tolls were charged in both directions but the arrangements were changed in the early 1990s to eliminate the need for a set of toll booths for each direction of travel and the potential for traffic waiting to pay the toll backing up onto the bridge itself. In 1966, the toll for using the new motorway crossing was set at 260 for all vehicles apart from solo motorcycles which enjoyed a reduced toll of ones. For a small car the bridge toll represented a saving of sevens on the price, at that time 9 seconds 60 of using the ferry crossing. By 1989, the toll had reached a £2 each way for goods vehicle having an unladen weight exceeding 1.525 tonnes and passenger vehicles adapted to carry more than 16 passengers and a £1 each way for other vehicles. Currency depreciation has been a feature of UK monetary policy in the intervening decades, and the RPI is a widely applied surrogate for the resulting impact of general price inflation, if the seven toll had increased in line with general inflation since September 1966, when Queen Elizabeth II opened the bridge, the original value of a £0.125 would have reached a £2 and two pennies each way in January 2010. As of January 2015, the toll is a £6 and 50 pennies for a car, increasing to a £19 and 60 pennies for a heavy goods vehicle. Motorcycles and disabled badge holders are exempt from the tolls, although both must stop at the toll booths to have their eligibility confirmed, and also to allow the barrier to be raised. The tolls for the second seven crossing are the same, although in that case, the tolls are collected on the Welsh side, sufficiently far from the bridge that even severe queuing doesn't reach it. A system known as the 7TAG made by Amtec is also in operation which allows drivers to pay electronically without having to stop at the toll booths. TAGs are available either on a per trip or a seasonal basis, although only the latter attracts a discount. Credit debit cards were not originally accepted on either bridge, but drivers who did not have the means to pay were able to get a bill from the toll operator and pay by post later. Card payment was made available in time for the 2010 Ryder Cup. 
however, users would be required to enter their PIN and cash was still the recommended payment method to avoid delays. The cycle path and footpath, which run along either side of the roadway, may be used free of charge. Only the original bridge has such a public access. Equals historic overview of the charges equals Ownership Ownership and operation of the bridge passed to Seven River Crossing PLC on April 26, 1992 as part of the deal to build the second Seven Crossing. As of November 2010, Seven River Crossing PLC was owned, 35% John Lying, British developer infrastructure operator, 35% Vinci, French concessions and construction company, 15% Bank of America, American Multinational Banking and Financial Services Corporation, 15% Barclays Capital, British Multinational Investment Bank. The company's 2011 annual report showed the same companies still owned, through subsidiary companies, all the issued ordinary share capital of the PLC. Ownership of the bridge and the second seven crossing will return to the UK government when the revenue required to build and maintain them, as defined in a concession agreement with the Secretary of State for Transport, has been collected. In 2010, the concession was expected to end in 2017. In 2012, changes were made to the agreement to reflect the effect of changes in VAT and corporation tax and the costs of installing credit card handling systems. The net effect was to increase the required revenue from A995.83 million pounds to A1028.91 million pounds in 1989 prices. 40-year inspections, during its 40th year of operation, the bridge was inspected to check for corrosion of the suspension cables. According to the Highways Agency, the inspection concluded that the bridge needed restrictions on heavy goods vehicles. Such vehicles are now restricted to one lane on the bridge, with weight restriction signs in place. A system of installing a rubber casing on the cables with dry air circulation is to be used on the fourth road bridge and a similar system may be implemented on the Severn Bridge, in a move to halt the progress of the corrosion. Simultaneous closures in 2009, on February 6, 2009, during a week of snowfall throughout Britain, both seven bridges were closed simultaneously due to ice falling from the bridge structure and damaging vehicles. On December 22, 2009 both bridges were closed again for the same reason. This was only the third time that both bridges have been closed together, the first being due to a chemical fire in Avonmouth some years earlier. See also, List of crossings of the River Severn, List of crossings of the River Y, Ost Severn Powerline Crossing. References External links, Seven River Crossing PLC, Seven Bridge at Stroke Shuri Street 58 NE Ost M4 Motorway, Images of England, Bridge Celebrates 40th Birthday, BBC News, September 8, 2006, Archive Pictures of the Bridge Being Built, Video of the Queen Opening the Bridge in 1966, Motorway Database, M48, Seven Bridge Traffic Webcam.